North Korea has once again showcased its missile might in the Korean Peninsula. South Korean government on Sunday reported that the North has fired an unidentified ballistic missile towards the East Sea. Following the ballistic missile launch, Japanese Prime Minister's office dubbed it an emergency alert. Here's more. North Korea once again fired an apparent intermediate range missiles into the sea on Sunday as tensions run high after Pyongyang's recent launches of an intercontinental ballistic missile and its first military spy satellite. North Korea has stepped up pressure on South Korea in recent weeks, declaring Seoul the principal enemy. North has said that it will never reunite with the South and vow to enhance its ability to deliver a nuclear strike on the U.S. and American allies in the Pacific. Sunday's missiles launched from the area of Pyongyang around 2.55 p.m. flew about 1,000 kilometers off the country's east coast. The maximum altitude was at least 50 kilometers and the missiles appear to fall outside Japan's exclusive economic zone. South Korea's military says that Seoul has been running an analysis on the missile in coordination with the United States and Japan. Japan's Defense Ministry criticized the launch as a violation of United Nations resolutions. In November, North Korea said it successfully tested solid fuel engines designed for intermediate-range ballistic missiles. In December, it said it had tested its newest intercontinental ballistic missile to gauge the war readiness of its nuclear force against what it called mounting U.S. hostility as Washington and its allies began operating a real-time missile data sharing system. North Korean soldiers brought heavy weapons back to the demilitarized zone around the north-south border and they stored a guard post that the two countries had demolished after Seoul suspended part of a 2018 military accord between the two Koreans in a protest over Pyongyang's launch of the spy satellite. North and South Korea remain technically at war because the 1950-1953 Korean War ended in an armistice rather than a peace treaty. Pyongyang's isolated government is forging close ties with Moscow. Moscow and Pyongyang have denied conducting any arms deals, but vowed last year to deepen military ties. The United States and its allies have condemned what they described as Russia's firing of North Korean missiles at Ukraine, with Washington calling it abhorrent and Seoul calling Ukraine's a test site for Pyongyang's nuclear-capable missiles. The U.S. State Department on Thursday imposed sanctions on three Russian entities and one individual involved in the transfer and testing of North Korea's ballistic missile for Russia's use against Ukraine. Sayed Afsarul Hassan reporting for DD India.